welcome to World War II Wendell. We've come back to this 15th century stone constructed six arch bridge because we've had a tip off from viewer Laura Jessica that there may be some goodies to be found here. As you can see this spot has obviously been recently magnet fished by somebody else. So we're going to turn our attention to a little bit further out. We've brought on the canoe and our calamir has volunteered to go out and magnet fish from the canoe. Thank yep. you, Cal. Yep. We've never tried this before, so it could go absolutely disaster disastrous, disastrously wrong. Easy for me to say. This canoe's not been in the water for about seven or eight years. There's loads of life jacket on. He has got a life jacket on. We're not silly. Now he's got to lift his bum up. He's got to put his hands on the side because it's only a, a junior. Hands on the side. Yep, that's it. That's it. Slide in. That's it. Oh, how do you feel, Callum? All right. You confident? Now Callum is an experienced canoeist, so we're not just chucking yeah. him in at the deep end, yeah. he knows what he's doing, he's done it in the cadets. Yeah. He's off look, look at the boy look go. Him, yeah. uh, the one thing is, he's, he's clearly not got a magnet. <laughs> <laughs> he's got a turn around. Callum, could you get under that thing in that big life jacket or you got to go round? Uh, I'll go round. You go round, I tell you what, we'll meet you off that little jetty just there. Is that alright? Yeah. You alright? Yeah. You're doing it. Yeah. Shout if you need us, because Ian is the lifeguard for the day. Yes. Oh, he's nearly gone. He's just turned too fast. Just take it slow so you get used to the boat, mate. Okay. The reason we're in a junior canoe before people start slagging us is because we're in the van and it's the only one we could fit in the back. We couldn't get the full-size ones in, so me and Ian can't even have a go, can we? No, disappointed. Very disappointed. Right, let's get down on that jetty you can see just there. Let's do some magnet fishing. It's, you're supposed to be going around this way. <laughs> this way. You can't get around that way. There's no gap. To the shallows. You ain't gonna be able to duck in that life jacket. It's just gone over. Iceberg! <laughs> uh, I've actually got, for the history lovers, I've got a photo taken while well, this bit here is under repair. It's taken from over there, uh, dated 1912. We'll put that in about now. And there used to be a boathouse just over there. There are a little wharf just over there as well that served all of Belgrave. We're in Belgrave, Leicester. Use Cam's magnet, I think. I don't want him uh, having an accident. So what we're gonna do, Ian's gonna tie the magnet to himself. Callum's basically gonna take the magnet, drop it, give it a bit of a pull, because obviously we don't want it too dangerous for him. But he's gonna get it out to places people have never been before. We were actually here yesterday, and we bumped into the viewer, Laura. Nice. Yeah. yeah. And um, we are actually doing a geocache. We do geocaching now. Yes. We were doing a geocache at this bridge. We were just finding one. And uh, she told us there was a load more stuff being dumped in here. And she's sent us a few photos. Uh, yeah. And it's interesting stuff. Yeah. So we're hoping we're going to find some of it today. Yeah. Are you ready then? Right, go sort of to the end of the rope then, Cal. Any direction you want apart from over them logs. Yeah. And then you drop it in. If you want to pull it up, then Ian will pull it up. And then what we'll do is we'll obviously progress this. Has he crashed? I can't see for you. We're just very conscious of uh, not having him over with the rope. Okay, go then. You're free. Come on, Cal, you're free. Hey, don't go too fast. Yeah, you're going to have him in. Stop. Let go of the magnet quick. You're going to have him in. <laughs> Stop. This is very much work. Dump the magnet then. Being fair, you probably could have just bleeding thrown the magnet in. Yeah, you be on eyes, Callum. See if you can see anything, any targets. Do you think you'll be all right tying the magnet to you and dropping it in? Huh? Do you think you'll be all right tying the magnet round your waist What's and dropping that? it in? Yeah. Oh, he's on. He's on. Anything? Yeah. Not sure what. I'm guessing a pedal off a motorbike. Is it? Looks like it. I don't know. Is it? No. A no. couple of bits though. Yeah, I'm guessing that's off a moped. No, like a kickstart. Oh. There's the old there. Looks up sort of range though, can't it? Yeah, could could be. Be yeah. Go and have a paddle out there, Cal, right under them bridges, see if there's anything to uh, magnet fish. Yeah. Hey, quack, quack. Is it Donald? Huh? Uh, he's gone to shop. He's gone to shop? Yeah. He's got to get us some drinks. And food. Anything? 
While he's gone for a paddle then, let's do a bit of actual magnet fishing here, Ian. Come on. Yeah. Well, while Callum's looking at, uh, around for anything in the water, enjoy yourself, Cal. Yeah, I'm Good man, no, all right. <laughs> Good man. Uh, Callum, uh, James is fishing over here, and I've just got a call. Seems like I'm on to it. Oh, it might be a tree. Might be a false alarm. Oh, it's something. No. Oh, it's a big piece of pole. Old pipe. Iron pipe, that. We'll keep fishing. Yeah. Look at that, my brother, he likes pipe. Go ahead, Joe, let's see you chuck the magnet in, mate. Seen this for a while. What's that? Me? Yeah. No, I don't get any of this fun anymore, do I? Well, there's no one's magnet fished this bit. Yeah. Because that bit over there is magnet fished off to death, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, there's another piece of pipe. Yeah. Come on, come on. Yeah. Different sort of pipe, that. Yeah. Different sort of pipe, that. Yeah. Different sort of pipe. That looks like... Uh, recycle. Callum, stay safe. What's my rope? Stay safe. Yeah. Well, well, had the call from James again. Callum, what's that? I've only got half of it, whatever it is. Or is it another bar? Walking stick. Oh, walking. <laughs> Did we want a walking stick? No, not really. Not a rifle. Damn. Not a rifle. This was a home guard bridge, this, in the Second World War. So we're hoping for something like rifling. Yeah, because I found a bullet last time. You did find a bullet down here, didn't you? There's old Callum Lock, still having fun. <laughs> you took your drink in with you? Yeah. Did you take your magnet in with you? Do you feel confident to have your magnet with you? No, I wouldn't. So there you go. Can you magnet fish from a canoe? The answer is not very easily. I won't be safe either. No, not really. You have to be very experienced. You do. No, you caught someone. Yeah, him. What you caught? Him. him. That's it. He's a mermaid. <laughs> Merman. Merman. <laughs> Some of our viewers just walking across there now. Mystery object. Still a mystery. No. That is off a set of trailers. I'm guessing. Push bike. Push yeah, bike. Push bike. Yeah, that, that's a. No, it's not a mudguard, is it? That's a wheel. It looks like a well, wheel. Here's the canoeing class coming down, so we might have to uh, halt proceedings yeah. for a minute. We are sailing. We oh, are sailing. sailing. Whatever that is, I have got it. Oh, he's got it. It is. It is. It is. It is what we thought it was. What's that, Cal? A knife. It's a knife. Yeah. Look at that. What's that doing in the river, Cal? Pass it, pass it, pass it. Pass it. And then no, you get your fingerprints on it. Yeah, that's one of those no. poles, isn't it? I was going to turn it. It's not a knife. Oh, no, very good. This is a knife. Yeah, we just found a knife. Thank you very much to viewer Jessica. Pointing that out. We could see that. Oh, it's an IKEA look. IKEA. Should just. Callum's just come round this side of the bridge then and he's giving in the shout that he's found something decent round here. 
So Ian's dropping the magnet down. Hopefully Callum's going to drop it onto it, and we're in business. <laughs> yeah, Ian is still tied to this magnet. We've done a risk assessment. Don't go too far out, Cal. He's out there somewhere. I don't know where he is. Oh, there he is. Where you going? Let go. Where are you going? Drop it there now. Drop it. Drop. Drop. Bloody hell. You'll have him in. Bus. Bus. No, it's not there, mate. Wait. wait, wait, wait. Don't pull, don't pull. Yeah. Well, we ain't moving, mate. I can see it. Do you see what he's looking at? Oh yeah. yeah pull it, pull it. I can't. Is it heavy? Bubbles. 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 Wait, wait, wait. Is that something big, Cal? Yes. What is it? A bike. Is it a bike? I know I saw something. <laughs> Hold it. Uncle Ian, look, thinks he's got the muscles. Gee, my help. I ain't got my gloves on. It's a bike. It's a folding bike, isn't it? Oh, hey, it's got a badge on it. What's that say? Ravina. Don't go under the bridge, car. <laughs> You're dropping the bits on Seaweed head. Yeah, don't come under here. Callum, get yourself to the edge then, we'll come and get you out. Hey, our bike. Tom Clean's going to do the crazy frog. Hey, yeah, it's a, it's a crazy frog from Clean. <laughs> Is it stuck too? So that's it for magnet fishing here today then. We've learnt a couple of lessons. One is, canoes ain't much use when it comes to magnet fishing of the cow. Not much use at all. And the other is, doing a crazy frog on a folded bike ain't easy. But Uncle Ian's managed to unfold it. Let's have it. Does the bell work? <laughs> Nearly. Go on, Ian. <laughs> Wee! There you go. World War II Wendell. Like and subscribe. Canoes are rubbish for magnet fishing. It's official. Stay awesome. See you next week. Ciao. Let's do ciao.